So my beautiful people, there is a secret hidden dragon boss who is incredible. He is incredible, amazing. But what's even better is his rewards. Today, I'll get into it all. How's it going guys? My name's DPJ and if you do enjoy the video, leaving a like it really helps out and if you like what you see and want to see more, be sure to subscribe. Okay, so upon the dragon temple, there is a hidden boss. A crazy looking two-headed dragon snake. I don't know what it is, but it's amazing. What's even better is his rewards. Now, before I showcase you guys the exact location of how you get to him, firstly, let me show you what you get. So you get a bit of magic, a bit of magic. Uh, I can't even pronounce that, guys. Plexida, Sidoxidex is ruined. That's what we're going to call it. We're going to call it the ruin because it ruins enemies. Check this thing out. What is this? <laughs> Jesus. Whoa, it goes up in the air as well. Let's check that out again. I use it a lot of your focus points, though. But it does some serious damage, people. Ba -ba Boom. And then, guys. We have the weapon, which is this right here, the Dragon King's Crag Blade. Now check this out. This is incredible. Boom. Boom. <laughs> and I think you can hold it. For, if you hold it, I'm sure it can go further. I'm sure it can. Let's have a look. We can. I think my controller is just rubbish. It's fun as heck though. Oh yeah, you can. Yeah, 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 you can. If you hold it, you can, you can. Pretty cool, pretty cool, guys. So yes, these two incredible weapons, guys, are located within the Dragon Temple, which is endgame. It's endgame. Let's just put it that way. I mean, you will eventually get to here, guys. There's no rush. I want light ears. But once you get here, once you kill the, the fire giant up here within the mountain tops of the giants and come up here and activate... Uh, we'll speak to Melina at the Grace. You'll get teleported down here. You know, I might as well just show you from the very point. I mean, because you can just spawn in. I think it's there. And then straight to it. But if I showcase it to you guys from here, what do you reckon? What do you reckon? Oh, yeah, yeah, I'll do that. I'll do that because I know a lot of people pro probably be just getting here. and want to get these. So, yeah. You will have to take out all the Godskin duo on your way to this. So, keep that in mind. Um, but we'll, when we, when we you'll, I think actually when you first come here, you spawn down there. So yeah, you'll come past this grace, activate that grace 100%, you need to do that. And then just run this way, people. Run this way, get a jog on, because we ain't stopping to fight nothing, because things hit hard up here. Now when you first get here, there will be a giant ancient dragon that tries to land on your face. Well, I've already killed him. I've already killed him. So you want to keep coming this way, guys? So I'm just pretty cool as well, isn't it? I got this from up here as well. I got this from up here, guys. Killing the main dude here, actually. So I'll just keep coming this way. And then jump through here. There'll be another grace there, which you want to activate. A quick edit, no one saw because I completely went the wrong way, but that's all fine. That's <laughs> all good. It's all good. Okay, so you want to come down here, people. Come down here. Come down here. And you want to go out that door. You want to go out that door, don't hang about, just run. Just run and activate that grace. You want to activate that beautiful grace right here. And then guys, we follow this path down here. Ignore all the enemies. Just jump down. You can jump down this way, which is probably the better way. You know how many times I died <laughs> on this map? I died so many times. I died so many times. That's it. I think that's one of the only dragons here I haven't taken out yet. He's going down one of these days, let me tell you. He is going down one of these days. So I keep coming this way. Like I said, ignore everything you can. Don't hang about because these things hit super, super hard. Yes, they do. Just keep coming. Just keep running. Just keep running, people. <laughs> and you eventually come to that grace right there. Jump there and activate that grace. I'm going to sit down just to get the aggro off me. From here, we want to run through here, guys. There's going to be an enemy right here, so you want to jump over him if you can, like a ninja. Oh, I'm not a ninja. Yeah, he just hit me straight in the ass. That's good. That door will be uh, 
big, you know, the yellow fog. You won't be able to go through. You'll have to come down this way. So I don't know why that door's there, to be honest, but either way. So, yep, this will be the Godskin duo fight, which you have to take him out. And then there's a Grace right there. So once you take him out, activate this Grace. I'm going to do it again because them dudes are on my ass. And we don't want that. Okay, so then you just come down this way. Come down this way, people. Come down this way, people. And then you want to go down there. But again, be careful here because these dudes hit hard. Whoop. Dodged him. I'm a ninja. I'm a ninja. Just run out. Just run. Just keep running. Straight through here. Just like that. Past these guys. Jump. Oh, shit. Something hit me. Shit. Okay. There we go. Now keep going. Keep going. Keep going. You want to take a sharp right here. Ignore that dude there. There we go. There we go. Now you'll eventually come to this guy's. And again, you have to mantle across. There's a couple of collectibles under here. There's one on the edge there, and there's one behind you there, which I died a couple of times trying to get to. I actually lost 450,000 runes, falling off, and then trying to get my runes, I fell off again. Yeah, believe that. Believe that, people. That guy, guys, ignore this dude. Just run straight around here. Ignore him. Take no notice of him. And you want to jump down there. And then you want to activate this grace right here. Get out of it, boy. Get out of it. Okay, so now we want to jump down. And then jump down again. And there's going to be... Well, there's normally a dragon there. I've killed him. But it's going to be a dragon shooting thunder down on your ass. And you're going to have to be dodging it like a ninja. You're going to have to be like in and out. Don't worry about the birds. The birds are nothing. You can roll out the way of them. The thunder, though, is nasty. So, yeah, you will have to be careful about that. But you can, out, you can outrun the birds quite easily, to be honest. Quite easily. Now, I think the dragon actually helps you out with... I can't remember, to be honest. I did it quite a few days back. Now, you want to jump up here, but be careful, because there will be thunder on the edge. Let's run straight. That dragon will be sitting there. You just want to peg it up here, people. Let's peg it as fast as you can. Don't worry about the birds. Ignore the birds. Forget them. Just keep going. Keep. It's not an area you want to stop in. Trust me, it is not. Let's come around here, guys. Ignore him too. Just jump down and run straight across there. Do not even stress about that. Just run. Run. And run. Ignore this dude with his boomerang as well. He thinks he's bad. Forget him. And from here, guys, is where you jump off. It's literally right down here. Right here. And then you come down here, guys. And there. Uh, Come down here, just like so. I don't know if you can go back here once you kill him. There's a grace there, but I don't know if you can come back from this way. I don't know if you can come back from this way. So yeah, let's go, let's have a look. Probably can, to be honest. No, you can't. What do you do? You'll have a trigger here to lie down. But don't worry about that. Now, if you've already got to this point, if you're already past this point, guys, then you can always spawn in right there. It's over there or there. I think it's... Actually, you know what? I think it's that, yeah. Besides the grip bridge, that's it. If you've already gone, gone past this area and you just want to um, come back here quickly, yeah, it's from here. So you'll see the stairs up ahead. You want to turn back around and you want to call that lift. Now, I can't see. Is it there or not? No, it's not. So I'll call the lift. Call the lever. And you see that'll come up. That will come up. And let's jump on it and obviously activate it. Ba bap. Ba bap. Okay, don't want to do it. There we go. And then, people, as soon as it lands, you just want to leg it forward. Well, actually, no, you might. You'll have to come around this corner first. Come around this corner. Now you want to leg it forward. Past this enemy. Don't worry about him. He's pretty slow. And straight out of this door. Just run for your life, people. And there we're back at the exact same point we jumped down. So just jump down here and go from there, guys. And there we have it. Again, lie down on that bit of uh, sand or water or whatever it is. And then you'll get access to this secret dragon boss. And if you defeat him, you get this incredible, well, this pair 
the pair of incredible weapons and there we have it guys i will end the video there because it's gone on a lot longer than i actually thought it was going to do well there we have it people if you enjoyed the video leaving a like it really helps out if you like what you see and want to see more out of ring be sure to subscribe and hopefully people i will see you on that next one